Well, hello and welcome to the vlog. I'm a mess. Um, hopefully future Emily, because I'm now past Emily, has said hello to you guys. But it is the weekend before I close. So I'm actually closing, today's Saturday, by the way. Um, I actually need to, hold on, I'm gonna do this while you're here, so hold on. My house is a mess and um, I need to get my checks out, which I don't know who still has checks, but apparently I do. So I need to bring a check with me on Monday because because of COVID, my um, title company doesn't do like the closings and stuff together any longer, which totally respect that. That's awesome. Anyway, I had to get a check. I'm not gonna show you the check because that's weird. Um, I had to get a check because they needed like a voided check or something. Wow, I look like a hot mess. I should not have started recording right now. Anyway, but like I said, it is Saturday and I am just getting my life together as much as it can be because my house is a mess. So I'm currently in my office. I'm gonna take my check downstairs. I should bring my phone with me too. Um, but here's my office currently. Like it is a disaster zone. Um, I still have so much stuff to pack, you guys. Like, ah. the nice thing is I don't have to pack like anything that's on the walls, like like functional things that are on the wall, decorative things that are on the wall, I take with me. But like the shelf, I don't have to take with me because that's part of the purchase, as well as the curtains. Not the rainbow, but the curtains are part of the purchase as well as like the blinds and that stuff. Oh, and then also these lamps. So basically anything functional affixed to the wall is how we did that. So anyways, I figured I would show you guys around of just like what a mess my house is. Um, so yeah, <laughs> so we'll do that real quick. So here's my bedroom currently just... A freaking mess. I've got stuff everywhere. I'm loading up pillows in a bag right now. Um, and yes, I have red and white sheets currently. And um, took some stuff off the walls. There was a big painting up here, which I just listed on Facebook Marketplace. And I've got a bunch of shoes there. I have tons of clothes, you guys. I need to go through the clothes again. It's a, it's a situation. It is a situation, you know what I mean? Um, and then these are all of my clean clothes from the laundry that I've just stacked up. So yeah, I need to grab another. I got these like really cool bags. If I can find them, I'll link them. But for packing, like they're kind of amazing. And they're like these big square bags. They kind of remind me of those like Ikea bags. Anyway, but they're cheaper than Ikea bags. So here's the plan. I am going to spend this upcoming week, so today's Saturday, Sunday, I'm gonna be packing all day on Sunday. I currently have one of those pod things in my driveway. It's partially packed, it needs to get more packed. And that's another goal. They're picking that up on Wednesday sometime, like during the day when I'm at the office. And then I am gonna be spending the additional rest of the week at my parents' place. Another caveat to that is my brother is uh, staying at my parents' place currently too. So my brother is there. So, which is fine. I mean, it's a two bedroom. There's way more than enough room for the both of us. I am like kind of packing <laughs> like stuff. Uh, like pulling things out of my closet that I would probably want to wear for the next week or so. So my timeline for this upcoming week is I sign over the, my documents to sell this house on Monday, but it doesn't get sold to the buyer until Friday. So Friday at, I think it's, I think her closing is at 10 a.m. and then mine's at, is it 11 a.m.? I think so, I think that's I think that's the plan. They just need to get my stuff figured out beforehand on Friday, or sorry, not on Friday, on Monday. And then I purchased a new house as well. So I signed my documents on Friday also, but after my seller of this house. I know it's like super confusing. Anyway. Nice situation is that the person that bought my house 
didn't have a contingency of a previous sale, so that's fine. Um, and then the person that I'm purchasing from actually is out of state. So that residence has nothing in it, like no furniture, no nothing. Nobody was living there even when I toured it. It's just been sitting vacant, which is fine. So then on Wednesday, the pod people, that sounds weird, the pod people, the people from pods are going to pick up my pod on Wednesday and then they're gonna deliver it to my new address. Even though I don't live there yet or have even signed documents, it's getting delivered there. I've already cleared this with the sellers of the house I'm going to now live in and uh, it will be in an HOA, so I've cleared it with their HOA as well uh, that I can have it for a certain amount of days there and they said that's totally fine. So anyway, yeah, oh my gosh. There's a lot going on, you guys. So anyway, showing you more of the mess. More of the mess, oh my gosh, like, wrapping paper like why 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 I don't know um and the sad thing is is I have gone to the thrift store I want to say like three or four times already with donations it's bad it's bad actually the um it's looking pretty good in here um not that anyone wants to like see my bathroom but um it's looking pretty good in here uh so yeah that's good and, oh, I should move this. This is There's gonna be all the rumors on the internet. I'm not pregnant. It's a, <laughs> it's a COVID test. I'm fine, it's, it's fine, I'm fine. Um, anyway, I was just in close proximity with somebody that had COVID. I don't have COVID, but I have more at home tests um, to do over the weekend, make sure everything's on the up and up. But this is all like, even though there's a lot, it's pretty well maintained and contained, I should say. So like everything's like in like, a drawer thing so I just need to like really take this out and like put it in a box and then I'll be done and then I have all of my soft things up here which I'll put in those um, those white bags and uh, should be good to go there so anyway looking pretty good um, and then there's nothing really up here besides just um, like like little silly stuff Let's take a peek at what's going downstairs. Um, this is another mess. <laughs> All the things that need to go in the pod. Um, lots and lots of boxes. I got some boxes from the office. I actually have a box right there of some packing blankets. <sighs> lots of things. I'm trying to take things off the walls as I go. That still needs to come down. My whole... This is pretty empty for what it was like the safe was actually right in there um so yeah but just again needs to go in boxes like doyle he needs to get in a box right buddy yeah so uh, anyway um and then in this little hallway i have a ton of stuff i threw like a ton of shoes down the hall i don't know anywho but I'm trying to be a little methodical about my packing, like where things go and whatnot. So I'm labeling things, but I'm also using like, I already had these, like this little bin thing. There's like two big drawers and then two little drawers. And I'm trying to like, be like, this goes in the garage of like garage things, like a poncho. And it's got like, I don't know, some other random, stuff that I just don't need in here. Like, I don't know, there's a bunch of other random stuff. And then there's like some electrical cords I clearly don't need. So if I find stuff for the garage, then it goes in there. And then these black bags are donations. And then I also have, this is a bin full of donations. You're probably gonna ask yourself, Emily, why are you gonna donate a perfectly good like rubber bin? It's not perfectly good, sadly. Um, I got this delivered to me. Let me show you. And I bought them from Amazon. And I don't know if you can see it. Maybe you can see it now, but, 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 but a, little bit, a little bit better. It's actually cracked right here. Um, so the company was kind enough to send me replacements. Oh, Doyle's gonna check it out. Um, to send me replacements. I mean, it still works for like hauling things, but it's like cracked this like whole way. Anyway, 
So I'm gonna take that over to the thrift store when I get a chance. And my car is also still full of donations, so. And then I still have stuff set up over here. I've got more set up over here. It's kind of like my wrapping station. And I have like all of my paper. <laughs> I've got tons and tons of this like foam for like plates and things, which I haven't wrapped all of them yet. And then I have like a shit ton of mo moving blankets which I purchased, and I know you guys are probably thinking, Emily, why did you purchase so many of these? Well, here's the, here's the deal. I know that there's gonna be tons of um, moving happening in my family in the next year or so. My brother is probably gonna be moving soon, and then my parents also are gonna be moving soon. So, I figured make the investment and, you know, get some moving blankets. And I can use them for art, I can use them for obviously furniture moving blankets, um, which is like the most common thing. Um, so yeah, that's basically what I'm gonna use it for. And then I did get one of these things, I think I got this from like Target or somewhere. It's basically like a furniture cover condom thing. <laughs> it's just like a um, plastic cover for your sofa. I wanted to get this just because of the upholstery and then on the base of like how I'm gonna set this up in the pod, I'm gonna put a um, furniture blanket on there to just have like double protection, you know what I'm saying? And then last time I moved, I used this little bad boy. Highly recommend getting one of these. Um, it's like, like a little saran wrap thing on a little thing. You just go round and round your item. So good, especially with the um, the moving blankets works really, 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 really well. Um, I have no idea how I'm gonna piece this like vliggity vlog together because I have not um, vlogged anything or even filmed a video in over a year because of things that hopefully future Emily has already talked to you about, but we'll see. We'll see how this all goes. It'll probably have to be several videos because it's, it's a long story. Anywho, but I'm gonna get to Gittin and uh, hopefully when you see me next, some of this will be cleaned up. So I'm using you guys' motivation right now because all I really wanna do is just like sit down and take a nap and like not do anything because just like crippling anxiety and just like I just can't. <laughs> I just don't wanna do anything. Ah! But I have to, but I'm the only one that can do it. So it's just, I've had so many friends reach out and say, oh, can I help move or whatever? I'm like, you can help me move stuff, but the actual packing is only me. So, because I wanna go through everything and I don't wanna puck, puck. <laughs> I don't wanna pack unnecessary stuff. So that's kind of the name of that game. But I'm gonna see you guys in just a little bit.
folks, it's time to kick it old school. Uh, so you can feel cool. <laughs> Give it to me, baby. <laughs> baby. <laughs> yeah. 